To understand the concept of a mnemonic phrase, let's remember that Bitcoin at its core deals with numbers. A Bitcoin private key is essentially a numerical sequence like Bitcoin address or a digital signature. So what exactly is a mnemonic phrase? Well, it's a collection of 12 to 24 English words which is used to back up your Bitcoin wallet. When you set up a non-custodial or a hardware wallet, you are often prompted to write down these words. This standard is defined by BIP39 or Bitcoin Improvement Protocol 39 which is the foundation for these seed phrases. So here is a key idea. A 24 words mnemonic phrase is just a number. These words are drawn from a dictionary of 2048 words. Each word can be mapped to a unique number between 1 and 2048, creating a numeric encoding system. To clarify, when you write a number in decimal, you use the digit 0 to 9, where the position of each digit matters. By combining these digits, you can generate some substantial amount of numbers. For instance, a Bitcoin private key is a 77 digit decimal number, which is equivalent to 10 to the power of 77. Now let's consider mnemonic phrases. A 24 word phrase is effectively 2048 to the power of 24, which is similar in the scale to 2 to the power of 264. It is slightly larger than a 256 bit number because it incorporates a checksum to prevent transcriptional errors. This means that guessing a 24 word mnemonic phrase is on par with guessing a Bitcoin private key or for a fun example, picking one atom from the entire observable universe. In conclusion, a 24 word mnemonic phrase is not just secure, but it's also a user-friendly method for safeguarding a Bitcoin wallet. It is much simpler to write down and recall 24 English words than attempting to record a 77-digit decimal or a 256-bit binary number. So rest assured, mnemonic phrases are a robust mechanism to safeguarding your digital assets. Keeping a mnemonic phrase safe is very crucial. Now we have discussed in a previous video about how traditional methods like using a paper backup or a metal plate is a single point of failure. Instead, you should switch to Cypherop X1, a hardware wallet which unlike other hardware wallets does not require for you to keep a seed phrase backup, thereby eliminating the single point of failure. If you found this video helpful, hit that like button, subscribe to Cypherox YouTube channel and make sure to check out this playlist which has videos about wallet security and this playlist which has videos about Bitcoin security. And next time, signing off.